Magandang araw sa inyong mga kaguro. Ngayong araw ay may bago tayong update at tungkol ito sa Marcos 1 sa Rata Emphasize Science, Math Education. Para malaman ang buong detalye, please watch this. Marcos 1 sa Rata Emphasize Science, Math Education. President-elect Ferdinand Marcos Jr. stated that improving educational quality, particularly in math and science, is critical since the Filipino young must keep up with rapid technological breakthroughs. President-elect Ferdinand Bongbong Marcos Jr. wants the Department of Education of DepEd, led by his running partner Vice President-elect Sara Duterte Carpio, to increase the quality of STEM education in the Philippines. Marcos agreed with one of the comments on his Facebook page on Saturday, June 4, that the government needs to produce more youth proficient in the sciences, particularly in research and development. You appeared to know exactly what I was thinking. Unfortunately, we do not fare well in comparison to other countries in terms of educational achievement in mathematics and the sciences. That's why our new administration, particularly the Department of Education, will have to place a greater emphasis on so-called STEM education, which is exactly what we need right now, the incoming president stated, partially in Filipino. Grade 4 pupils in the Philippines scored the lowest out of 58 countries in the 2019 Trends in International Mathematics and Science Study, TIMSS, the results of which were revealed in December 2020. Filipino students scored 277 in math and 247 na in science on average, well below the low international criterion of 400. Singapore, on the other hand, had the highest overall average in both grade 4 examinations, Scoring aning naraan at dalawang putlimang in math and limandaan at siyam na putlimang in science. Marcos acknowledged that the Philippines lags behind its neighbors in this area, but added, I believe that if we continue to push its STEM education, the Filipino kids can catch up. Panipi, improving the quality of education, particularly in math and science, is critical because the Filipino youth must keep up with rapid technological breakthroughs. Right now, our economy is essentially technical based on science, based on new technological developments. That is why we must learn about technology, how to enhance it, and how to apply it in the Philippines. Marcos stated, we need the talent. One of the primary areas that our Department of Education will be looking at is how to reinforce the instructions for our children and students, he continued. Duterte Carpio had previously accepted the nomination for the future DepEd Secretary and stated that she will shortly discuss Marcos on basic education goals. Carlo Arcelia, director of the DOST Philippine Nuclear Research Institute, PNRI, said the DOST Science Education Institute, SEI, has assured him of up to 20 scholarship seats for nuclear engineering students who choose to pursue studies abroad. Yun lamang ang ating update ngayong araw, please don't forget to like, share and subscribe to our YouTube channel and follow our Facebook page, BFAM Salamat.